I don't know how I ended up being so lucky as to pick the one bright sunny hot day to film outside, but it is scorching hot and I literally can't even tell if you guys can see me. I might literally be so overexposed. I, I don't know. <laughs> I can't see the camera. What is good in the hood? Yo, Derek here. For those of you that read the title, you read the title correct. I am going to be doing a little smoking get ready with me. Um, I'm not going to be showing the piece though. Like, I'll show you a part of the piece, like, so you know it's, like, truly, like, oh, oh my gosh. But I'm not gonna actively show you the piece, because it's filthy. I need to clean it. It's disgusting. So, I'm embarrassed by it. That's why I'm not showing it. Y'all better keep your mouths closed about my hair, though, because... <gasps> it's so long. Like, do not play me like that. My mom's car is in the dealership, so she's taking mine, like, to work and stuff. And so I haven't been able to go get a haircut. <laughs> and I need one. So, I don't know if I have to do this, but a little disclaimer, just in case. Um, I am 21 years old, so I'm allowed to do this stuff. I live in a recreationally legal state, Washington State, represent, what's up? Uh, so, this is legal. Don't you dare come for me, YouTube. Don't you dare. <laughs> Cue the choking montage. Now, for those of you that are wondering, I'm smoking on Juicy Lucy. feel nicely chilled uh i'll meet you guys upstairs <laughs> period we're now in my beauty space ready to do that beat and a little bit of a little chit chat little little chitty chat chat <laughs> for color corrector i go in with my color your world color corrector from tarte i literally i take this green and i just like dot it on all of my boo-boos on all of my uh-ohs and then I blend all of them in, literally, I just use my finger because why not? Like, why would I dirty up a brush when my finger does the job? Next, I usually use my Tarte Shape Tape. Literally, it's still my to die for, it's still my go-to. Um, I haven't rebought a bottle, so this is like super old. But you know what? It works. And make sure that you dot on all the places that you've just made green, just to make sure that you actually cover them. And then hit all of like your T-zone areas and anything that you like to conceal. I don't really have that big of bags. Bless. So I don't really have to like supremely cover any bag. However, I do have a little bag. And it is right underneath both of these little eyes that I have that are lopsided. Did you guys know my eyes are lopsided? That's fucked. Don't bully me with that, I'll cry. As it turns out, without foundation, I'm really bad at covering up pimples, but you know what? We're just gonna continue because I'll cover them with freckles. Now going in with my Laura Mercier powder, I'm gonna literally just bake all the places of my face because I get oily. For my eyebrows, I go in with this In The Flesh palette from MAC, and I use this black, and I fill my eyebrows with it because I've got, still got a little bit of black in my hair. I don't know if y'all see that. The tips of my hair is black, so we're about to be able to cut out all of the color, and then we're just going to be back to brown, and then I'm going to be able to do my eyebrows. I'm gonna be able to do my eyebrows brown. Out of all the palettes, highlighters, anything that I have, the only hand mirror that I have that hits so different are these ColourPop highlighter mirrors. Do you see? It's perfect. And it's like convenient to hold. Like I can go like this and I can perfectly see like the, my eyelash line and stuff. So I'll be able to like do my eyelashes good. That's why my eyelashes have been looking like 10 out of 10 recently. Me, rant about how so perfect that I'm perfecter than anyone else. Okay, baby Hannah is literally the most perfect, clean, literal, like, legend that nobody else can be on the planet. Like, everybody tries to, like, compete with her. They all lose. Every single person that's ever tried loses. Um, 
a legend. Like, period. I'm like, oh my god, I know what I'm gonna talk about. I don't know if you guys ever watch, like, tarot readings on, like, YouTube or whatever, but I've watched so many different people, and don't get me wrong, I think, like, most of them are fake. I have found somebody that I genuinely am like, she's a queen, she literally is spot on. Like, I don't even understand, like, how... Cause like I don't feel drawn to every single one of her card readings you know what I mean like some of them like I'm not meant to watch so I don't watch but the ones that I'm like I have to watch this I end up picking like a pile that's so good and she reads me to filth and her name is Shanetta I think it's Shanetta's Divine Tarot is her like YouTube I I literally love her I want her to be my friend and I'm supposed to be getting a boyfriend here not soon but like it could be soon it's like I'm supposed to be starting to like finally fix myself like fix like my habits that I had been doing that like kept me from like achieving getting a boyfriend like the energies weren't matching like I didn't want a boyfriend I was like aggressive when people would try and like a come and like be my boyfriend or something I don't even know she was explaining it better than me. Go watch the video. But creds to Shanetta for when I get a boyfriend, it's all creds to her. Oh wait, I forgot I'm high. <laughs> no wonder, I was like, why is this like taking me so long? And like, why is it so hard? Like it's easy, like I'm good at like art. No, I'm not, but like a little bit. Now I'm gonna skip until my eyebrows are done. Now going in with my MAC blush and peaches, I'm just gonna put it literally all over my face cause I still stand by making it look like I'm stun burnt. Like I wanna be burnt by that sun, fried. But I don't actually wanna be burnt by the sun and fried. You know what I mean? Like I'm gonna still sit in my room and like play on Twitter. But like I'm gonna put so much blush on my face that you would think that I sat outside all day. And if you can't stop looking at this brush because it literally looks like a cute ass little icicle, it is so good. It's from Moda Brush. I have a code with them. It's Derek if you want to get some money off, period. But I start by putting my blush on my cheeks and then I put it across my nose, but I kind of contour my nose a little bit with that. So I'll show you what I mean like when I get there. You might be wondering um, if I'm going to carve out my brows. I Yes, I am, but I do it after I blush because I like the look of having the blush carved out too, if that makes sense. So... I go in with my blush. I do my brows, then my blush, so I know how much blush to put because sometimes I put too much if I don't do brows first. <laughs> and then I go in with concealer around my brows, and then I do my freckles and eyelashes and stuff. The Makeup Virals asked me on my story, what do you usually have for breakfast? Good freaking question. And I'm like, it kind of depends on the day if I'm hungry. Some days I'm not hungry. Most of the time, actually, I'm not hungry. But... If I am hungry, I will go downstairs typically and get like a bowl of cereal. Sometimes I'll make like eggs and toast. Depends on if I'm like lazy or not. But most days I have like a cup of coffee or I'll have like lemon water. I'll put like a whole lemon into some water. And then if the lemon water is too like bleh for me, I'll add a little bit of ginger sometimes because lemon ginger water is super good for your health. Yes, I learned that from the DIY queens of like 2012. And yes, I actually still do it to this day. We got beef? Like what? You might be like, oh, so that's why your nose looks so snatched even though you just wear blush. Yes, it's the trick. You're welcome. The goal is to, at the end of the day, end up with a man's and make his pockets hurt. If you get that reference, you get it. If you don't, download TikTok. Time to carve these brows. So I'm gonna cut here and cut back when my brows are carved because I am very slow. But the brush I use is a Morphe M432 brush and I just take my concealer again and just literally carve out the top and then I carve, or I carve out the top up to like here ish and then I carve the bottom all the way and then I go up a little bit in the middle just to kind of meet them across to keep that one color you know what I mean brows are carved now I go back in with that black from the MAC palette and I go underneath my waterline it's like hold on it's like right here and, and I just kind of bring it up to my lashes 
lightly bring it to a little point in my mind this makes me feel like an ancient Egyptian and that's all I need in my life to be an ethereal ancient Egyptian in 2020 for my freckles, I go in with the Nude Mood eyeshadow palette from ColourPop, and I use the shade Moody. Literally, it matches, like, my freckles and, like, beauty marks that I already have in the color. And I feel like when I tap it out with my finger, it looks like it's already covered in concealer. And people literally are like, oh my god, like, have you been laying out in the sun? And I'm like, why would you ask me that? Is it because I put so much blush on and also put like sunspot freckles? Like, no, I haven't been laying in the sun. It's just makeup. Thanks. <laughs> now I'm just tapping them out. So that they blur a little bit, you know what I mean? I can get a real look at what they're actually gonna look like. Sometimes I literally don't know because some of these ones on this side are my real ones and I'm like, I don't know which ones, but that's good. That's what I want. Smoke break. Re-up, smoke break. Uh, Re-up, BRB. Uh. Hey, welcome to my smoke break. <coughs> I'm back from my second smoke sesh and I am pulling all of the glue off of these kiss lashes because I um my car my mom has my car because she needs it for work and I can't get to the mall to get a new pair and these ones are getting used <laughs> so I'm ripping the glue off and we're just gonna use them again but kiss lashes like I will do literally I'll do anything I'll get on my hands and knees and beg and plead I'll do anything <laughs> for a lifetime supply of kiss lashes and Chignon I don't know if I'm saying that right but C-H-I-G-N-O-N the best period I've never gotten so many compliments on a pair of lashes and we're going to be using our Becca highlight in, oh my gosh, <laughs> Pearl. This brush is also from a little pack. It's like a flower floral pastel pack that I got from Moda Brush. Don't forget, if you want it, use code Derek for some money off, period. Got to put some highlight on this Cupid's bow. Not for my cheeks, but for putting it on my face, I go in with a little bit of a bigger brush. I literally just kind of lightly try and put it at the balls of the cheek up and then blend it into right here. I think this one technically is an eyeshadow brush, but you know what? It's a brush. And this is what I find it to be the most useful for. Cause look at how beautifully that put that on. And that's on being exact. I'm just wiping this off on my pants because I'm gonna be going in for the first time with my Jeffree Star Blue Blood Palette. Thank you so much, Alyssa, for letting me have it. You're my bestie and I love you, bitch. I'm gonna be trying this Colonin. It's the white shade. Oh my gosh. In my eye. Oh my God, that is white. More white than I expected to see, but so like reflective. It's like silvery. Now going in with white eyeliner, I, I'm gonna try and see if I can do a white line instead. Period, wait, I kind of like that. 
I don't know if it's picking up completely on camera, but it is in person and it will on my phone. I see. Good combo. Some of y'all about to be real mad at me, but I do go in with the Wonderlux Volume Mascara from Rimmel London and do my bottom lashes and I don't do my top lashes yet. I only do my bottom lashes. Then I put my lashes on. Then I do a coat with my lashes. But look at how good this wand is. All I gotta say is I was sleeping on Rimmel London until they put me on their PR and they were like, here, try this. And I said, oh wow, I was deaf sleeping on y'all and I'm so sorry. But we learned our lesson and now we use her. So I'm gonna put my lashes on. For glue, I use Duo Lash Glue in clear. It's like the blue one. And I do a very, very thin coat of glue. And sometimes it takes me more than one time to put my, my lashes on. I'm not gonna be, I'm not even gonna lie. But I love this little mirror. It makes my life so easy. And these lashes, like I said, are Kiss Lashes in Chignon. And if Kiss Lashes wants to send me a lifetime supply, I would be more than happy. I'll wear them every single day. I already do. Oh wow, oh wow, good lash, good lash. Period. I don't think I've ever put lashes on, on camera before. Now we're gonna go in with one more coat of this Rimmel London mascara, and we're gonna be doing it on my top lashes, and I literally barely put any. I just need to make sure that these lashes blend into my lashes. You know what I mean? Which really isn't that hard. Ooh, so stunning. Ooh, who is she? Ooh, a model. Now going in with CoverGirl's Clean Fresh Tinted Lip Oil. I'm gonna be using it in the shade... Quench? Yes, in the shade Quench. And I'm gonna be putting it on my lips, obviously. But I think that this is the biggest, like, Hit from their clean fresh collection I'm not gonna cap it's my favorite in my opinion like they're so subtle and then I'll put like a lip gloss over top oh so slept on do you see that beautiful spritz this face with some urban decay all-nighter setting spray And that's still the bottle I bought, that's not from the PR. And we have to force this harshly straightened, re-curled at the root probably because I sweated outside hair to work for me. I can't see. Does my hair look fine? Do I look good? <laughs> and now for my final, 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 final step, I'm gonna be going in with a Stay Glossy Gloss from Rimmel London in the shade 710. I can't tell, it's either Money Honey or Honey Honey. Oh, my stomach just said gurgle, gurgle, gurgle. That's how you know I'm high. <laughs> I'm so hungry, I'm ready to eat. That's how you slay, period. Look at how cute I look. Bet y'all thought I was gonna do a bad job, huh? Wrong, period, I look that good, period. Thank you guys so much for watching. This video is so um, not what I've ever done before. Uh, if you enjoyed it, don't forget to give this video a like, uh, share it with your friends, comment if you want me to do any other crazy different stuff. Like I'm willing to do some crazy stuff, stuff that I've never done before, period. I love you, don't forget, you're beautiful, you always will be beautiful, and you're perfect, subscribe. <laughs> Stay smiley, or wait, be smiley, not gloomy. <laughs> I love you guys. Bye. <laughs>